Hey, good morning. This is Troy Kless with First Coast News. I'm down in Putnam County in the Elkton area. Um, and you can see this is uh, in the area where a tornado was reported earlier this morning. You can see the shutters um, uh, on that building over there. Um, the wind uh, completely taking them off. And I'm just going to kind of uh, take you around the scene right now. You can see there is a little bit of uh, standing water that you can see uh, here. Not too much, but I think there was uh, plenty of uh, wind damage in the area. Now, I'm going to show you some video. It might be tough to see because it was taken when the sun still wasn't quite up yet. But earlier today, when I first arrived here, we did see a tree that was down in the ramp that goes from uh, 207 onto 305 northbound. You can kind of see some of the first responders and there was a tree removal crew in the area. That uh, video that you see there, that's a piece of metal that was up in a power line earlier this morning that they were able to take down soon after um, the storm blew through this area. Now since I arrived, it's been very calm conditions, um, but you see, and like you kind of see there, some of the sheet metal that's on the ground in the aftermath of what happened here. So as of right now, um, everything, the conditions have calmed down, but there's uh, still a lot of, a uh, little bit of cleanup that needs to be done uh, in the area. But we'll keep you posted on whatever uh, we learn. And if there's anything that you saw in your particular neck of the woods and would like to share that with us, you can send us pictures uh, to, through our First Coast News Facebook page uh, as well.